Hi, it's Heather Smith here and I've got two upcoming sessions that I thought you might be able to help me with or share some of your own insights and experiences with. So they're both um, AI versus the human touch. So the first one is um, at the Festival of Accountants and Bookkeepers in Birmingham and I'm on a battle panel. <laughs> um, that is I'm debating AI versus the human touch and my opponent is Samuel Green of Employment Hero. Is AI uh, the answer to all of our problems or is it facilitating the return of the faceless accountant? Will the human touch be the killer app for 2024 or are we doomed and will AI take all of our jobs? So then I'm also been invited to discuss quite a similar topic on the Accounting Flow podcast. So the host of that podcast is Roman Villard um, and it's produced by Financial Sense and I'm on there to talk about balancing tech and touch, how to personalize client experiences in automated processes. So. I believe accountants naturally like balance. Um, it's something that I think is in our nature. Um, and while um, I, as an accountant, am very excited about technology, I can implement that I can implement. The balance to that is actually being human um, and it's improving the client experience. So my side of the battle is um, human. OK, so, so we're battling, we're debating, and my side is the human side. So I'm keen to flesh out any specific examples that you as accountants are leveraging to improve that client experience. So you're using technology, you're using the AI, and how are you using it to improve that client experience? So for example, during the onboarding process, you could customize collection forms to ask clients their preferred communication style or any specific needs that they have to help you serve them effectively. Now, I'm not encouraging you to create this deeply complex bespoke firm, but what are the options here for um, helping serve your clients effectively, offering that client experience, okay? So they could come back and say, well, we believe we're a visual learner. And so rather than give them a report pack brimming with numbers, use something like um, Fathom, which offers interactive visuals to, to explain what is happening in their business. If they say they're an audio learner, you could um, develop the report pack but then create a Loom video and talk them through it. Uh, explain the information. It also gives them an opportunity to go back and listen to it again. If they come out and say they believe they have ADHD, then you could take the report and you could use um, an AI tool to convert it into sort of a spaced out bullet points so as not to overwhelm them and so as to make the information sort of quite clear to them. Um, and, and, and these simple things that just are sort of one step beyond um, what, what maybe you were typically doing can offer that uh, uh, enhanced client experience. So keen to know if you have any specific examples that you as a, an accountant are leveraging to improve the client experience. And also, whose side are you on? Sarah Connors, the human, or Samuel Green, the Terminator. <laughs>